Our presidents, Charles Michel and Ursula von der Leyen, have done what we have asked them to do. They were tough on Xi Jinping and made it crystal clear that we expect China to help ending Putin's war. But, colleagues, Xi Jinping did not move an inch. To the contrary, the Chinese foreign minister declared there was no ceiling for China-Russia cooperation. And even after the massacre in Bucha, China has still not condemned the Russian invasion. Can you imagine? China is playing, if you ask me, a cynical game. It expects that both Europe and Russia will be weakened as a result of the war. Western sanctions will make Russia more dependent on China, and the EU will have to deal with the refugee crisis, high fuel prices, and economic decline. Let's face the truth. China does not act as a partner, it acts as a rival. After the crackdown on Hong Kong and the repression in Xi Jinping, China is again placing itself on the wrong side of history. Xi's end game is the end of the liberal rules-based world order. In our report, colleagues, and I see a lot of colleagues who worked on the report, we call for a more assertive strategy to become less dependent from China. We don't want a full decoupling from China. Let us speed up this process and learn from our experiences with that other autocratic regime. The cynical truth is that by buying so by being so dependent on Russian gas, we are enabling this war. So let's not make this mistake again. I call on the Commission to come forward with an analysis in which sectors China can hurt us and to propose a counter-strategy. Let us start to protect ourselves. If we care about our freedom, we better prepare for the worst. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now the floor to uh, Mr. Reinhard Butikofer for uh, two minutes and a half. Thank you.